also COVID-19 do bring huge challenges to all the DSO in the world. Taikang Bible Dental Group is the largest dental group in China. We are the biggest DSO. And uh, we also facing big challenges. Since this crisis, no doubt, it is a crisis. And uh, all the employees should be included for the campaign. We did a lot. First, and also it's very important thing is we engage every employee in our marketing campaign. We have totally 5,000 employees and uh, they promoted our product and the service. The good thing is we transfer all those dental service into product so that those product can be sell online. And uh, it is very successful. And we use WeChat and other social media. And finally come out is the most effective way for promoting our service. Find more new customers through the marketing. Second, we shield our marketing campaign from offline to online. And we held about 100 live stream online platform. We launched our online service plat platform and all our customers can access their personal dental health record, marketing appointment, and even buy dental products on this platform. Third, we maintaining our old existing customers, about 400,000 customers. During the crisis, within two months, all our patients cannot go to see our doctors and they are anxious. So we need to communicate with our customers through online platform. So let them maybe calm down and uh, they still believe in us. They know how to deal with their situation. In this way, so all the old customers still follow us. If we, you do nothing during the crisis, your custom can be other service custom. For the patient and the employee safety, of course, is a key. So we care about our employee more than everything else. Also, we care about each patient of us. And for the protocol, I don't want to talk too much, but there is one key it, that is very useful and important is contact tracing. If the patient already contacts some suspicious patient or one of the members of his family is infected by the virus already, they shouldn't come to our clinic. And plus, some area we call if come from high risk area, you have to stay at home more than two weeks before you can come to the clinic. And the third thing is you can use some new tactic like a smartphone. Uh, you can see like a low health code on smartphone. And uh, also the smartphone can help you to uh, track the contact tracing. Those help a lot. Plus, if the patient has a fever, they shouldn't come to our clinic. They need to go to special hospital to make sure they are not infected by the virus before they can come to see the dentist. The third thing is all our employees, if they have some suspicious contacting with other people who may infect the virus, they shouldn't come to the clinic. They need to stay at home for at least two weeks. And plus, if anybody of us, they have a suspicious symptom, they also need to stay at home. And those, I think, is very important for the safety of the patient and our customers. We do 
learn something from the crisis. And the crisis give us a very good lesson is for the DSU, you have to very high efficiency management. You want to expand it, you need to expand it not so quick. You need to make sure you can make profit before you are expanding. And you also need to make sure you have the ability to manage such big range of clinics before you make the decision. And uh, also, I think uh, all the DSO should keep a set liability ratio as a proper ranger. So that when the crisis comes, you have high chance of survival. That's the key that we learned. Thank you so much.